back to my channel. It's your boy D. Dyson, Deadpool, and Wolverine. Man, watched it today. I may watch it again. Yeah, movie of the year. Movie of the fucking year. Let's fucking go. We get a real, real Wolverine. The way he fights, the way he claws, he stabs, and the variance was just over the top. I loved the cameos, the fan service, top tier, the rifle ending to the Fox universe. Um, Cassandra Nova, I'm like, we'll see her again. I think that she's in a position where we'll see her again. Um, I think that they're going to build for Secret Wars. Yeah. I'm like, with Chris Evans coming back, I'm like, yeah. Yeah. You could tell Robert Downey Jr. is going to come back. You know, and um, just seeing how everyone is and how this it was well made i was like to see all the variants of deadpools i was like this was dope this was dope um i you know it's not saying it's a spoiler free because i'm like people watching tonight you know going on to saturday i think we can uh drop the spoilers um just to see wesley snipes blade and he was just like it's never gonna be another blade and i'm just like you know i'm like you know it was good to see him as Blade, you know, to get that send off. And, and then with him and Ryan Reynolds, like, I know you, I never liked you, that type of stuff. So it was like real, it was like real, but I love to see that Ryan Reynolds really brought him back, which was dope. It was an ode to Blade, to Elektra, um, to the Channing Tatum Gambit movie that we were supposed to get and making fun of his dialect, um, that we got to see X-23, Laura, and even bringing her back as a variant that I'm like, yeah, we will need her to come back in. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I just look at it like that is needed. That was needed. This was needed. This definitely brought back Marvel um, to a really good Marvel movie. I definitely cannot wait to watch this again. I haven't said that about a Marvel movie since. No, I said that about Loki. I said that about Loki season two. It would have been dope to see Loki, but I love to see the TVA after Loki. That's what's dope. Because even when uh, B B23 or B53 um, saw uh, Peter, I was like, I think she was married to him in another multiverse. That's why she looked at him and was like, you look so good because I think they were married. If I'm not mistaken, I think they were like in Loki. So I'm like, it's a lot of tie-ins, a lot of introducing, and I love that they, they say mutants because the mutant saga is coming. It's going to be into the multiversal saga. It's going to blend all, it's going to blend and mesh well so together. I'm here for it all. I'm here for it all. People, I, I gave it a solid 8.5. This is a solid 9 out of 10. Um, enough heart in it from Wade Wilson. You know, from Deadpool, enough heart from uh, Wolverine as as he felt sorry. And I was like, it would have been dope to see what happened in his timeline, how he let them down. It would have been dope to see that. Like Cyclops fall, everyone fall. It would have been like a good flashback that we would have got more depth with that Wolverine. Um, I would I would have loved to see that. Paradox, I was just like, you know, to introduction to him, he was pretty cool. But I would have been like, where's Mobius? Because I was like... Why is Paradox running there and where's Mobius? Unless Mobius left and, and just probably became a variant where he stayed, you know? So that's why I was kind of like, love seeing this and seeing how this all came because this really came together really, really well. I'm here for it all from start to finish. And for them to, to survive, I was like, you know they're going to be in Secret Wars. You know they're going to be in Avengers. You know. And to see that Wolverine was fighting against the Hulk, I was like, man, the teasers, all of it. I would have loved to see Wolverine go against Thanos and see why Thanos got the three scratches, or the claw scratches across his face. 
that would have been a good tie in to be like, that's why Thanos has the three scratches across his face. But the the way the stylized fighter, of course, Deadpool's gonna come with the with the with the guns, with the katana, but to see Wolverine like like pouncing around and, and just working, I'm like, man, that was dope. I was like, that that first 35 minutes was like mwah, cinema. Yeah, I'm here for it all. So you guys enjoyed my review of Deadpool and Wolverine. Subscribe to my channel. Post a comment down below. Like the video with your boy, D. Dyson. Peace.